That's my girl. I owe you. Again. My turn to be bait, I guess. Well, I always did find you attractive. Lucky me. How? This should have been total overkill. Buddy, I'll show you overkill. It was just a job. The overseer says kill, I kill. You know how it is. I don't get a say. I want out. I don't care how good the money is. It's not worth it. You're begging the wrong person. Your call. Dues paid. Finished? You know, I was actually starting to miss you. Liz, meet us back at the ship. People stand on. Glad to see you both made it back okay. Be back on the hunt? We'll head out after a little R&R. &R. I think it's deserved. Seconded. One of Tormund's lackeys forwarded a star chart to a system called Voss. The place isn't even on most maps yet. There's a lot of scuttlebutt about Voss's discovery on the Holonet, but it's pretty far-fetched stuff even for spacer superstition. The astrogation computer's updated and ready to go when you are. So, what do you know about Hilo Viz? I've heard the name. She was some big time spacer, wasn't she? Ah, you could put it that way if you're partial to understatement. She broke the Mandalorian blockade at the Hidian Way. You know, the one that strangled Coruscant and dashed a full scale Jedi assault. And it wasn't out of the goodness of her heart either. Credits were involved, a lot of them. I like her already. Oh, she was quite the lady. You could say that run was the height of her career, but that's only because she dropped off the scanners not long after. Most think the Huts were behind Hilo's disappearance, but anyone who knew her could tell you they'd have better odds winning a marathon. No, she's still out there. Somewhere. Never took you for the type to get starstruck. What now? We've got history. Hilo was my old partner. More than that. That blockade run was the last thing we ever did together. Like I said, a lot of credits were involved. When I saw the opportunity, I took off and left Hilo holding the bag. Stupid. Is that a conscience showing? I don't know, maybe. It was a dumb move I regret making. Listen, I found out that an old associate from that blockade run is still around and kicking. A mutual acquaintance. I owe Hilo one last visit. If he knows where she's been laying low all this time, I've got to track him down. You got crummy taste in company. Bad enough with that skinny broad and the little twerp trying to walk tall. But I don't get how that squeaking thing in the belly aching dandy ain't become target practice yet. How a hard case like you get tangled up with such a bunch of dainties? It'd be a mistake to underestimate any of my crew. Yeah? I ain't buying it. None of your tagalongs would have lasted two minutes with any of my crowd. I can't picture you as a people person. Live around by myself. Ain't much of a party. Had a good thing going back on Coruscant. The Empire shook that place up real good. No law. Just unclaimed turf. Millions of dregs clawing at each other for the scraps. One big round-the-clock brawl. <laughs> Shame it didn't last. The Republic send in the troops? Eh, uh, Peg and Order got sorted out, gangs formed, party ended. Still, turf wars were fun. My gang was top of the pack. Black Sun were killers to the core. Not like those lazy, stinking huts. Wonder what they've been doing since I got nabbed. Gotta go find me something to break. Go ahead, Blizz. Chita Hooper! You're not Lishka Chanaga, Wachi. Costa Yuna Kontrinka. Da 
bússola. Que é chatão, nunca tu e mamãe. This is great, Blizz. I'll be sure to show it off to everyone. Ah, opa, mal anca tudo está. O do ano vai dar suca cupa. Just call your skia chamada. Bumba, com chinga. Usa no pachão que fa, guta de outro, indiga. What makes them irreplaceable? We panega tweepy. Hey, boca donco, wanna wanga. Punta zuza nerco, higa da loira, oca ta uza zul. Just try not to get your hopes up, all right? Higa banga! Sa ponca ultman gisa, chobod i kafu anchala. Ever eaten Mandalorian food? At your adoption, maybe? Is that your way of asking me out? Maybe. Thought I might make you some tingular. See what you think. Pick a time, and we'll have dinner. Good. Plan on it later. Think of it as a challenge. They say any woman who can survive a plate of tingular is a keeper. I'll fix you some soon as I can get back to the galley. That friend I said you reminded me of? Got a hollow call from him. Turns out Cordan heard about us taking down G-Cone on Terrace. Sent me an invitation. He didn't draw a line in the sand, I hope. Over G-Cone? No. He'd have done the same as us. Said he's hunting big game. Offered to let me in on it. Plan to take him up on that. Wanted to let you know. Won't be long. Not going to introduce me to this friend of yours? Don't like competition. Cory Dan had spent the trip trying to impress with you along. I want you to meet him. Got catching up to do first. Catch you later. How was it? Amazing. Met Cory Dan and half my unit on Duxon. Good hunting. Bomas and Maurers mostly. Jagger bag to Zock Egg. Lucky Jare. Did my big hunter skin as a fireside rug? Tried. Malras aren't known for their hide. Just their mange. Got a few more stories to tell. Can't ask for much else. Back to hunting prey on two legs. Right. The Empire graciously welcomes you to Vos Orbital. Ambassador Yoran deeply regrets that he was unable to greet you personally. I've been instructed to emphasize the delicate situation you're walking into before you head for the surface. The Ambassador is concerned that your business could jeopardize the Empire's interests on Boss. My employer would argue otherwise. It's just that your kind aren't known for stepping lightly, you understand? The Voss are stubbornly isolationist and abundantly aware of their own value to the Republic and the Empire. It is vital that the Empire fosters goodwill. You must remain on your best behavior. I'll conduct myself accordingly. It's the nature of your profession that has the Ambassador concerned. The Voss abhor discord and don't tolerate violence within their territory. You'll mix peacefully with the enemy here. The Voss revere their mystics. D deal carefully with them, or, or preferably not at all. Also, outsiders are barred from Voskar proper. Should I be taking notes? No, no, those are the only specific points. Just use common sense. I will let Ambassador Yoran know to expect you. Head to his office once you've landed. Have a safe visit. Empire stepping lightly. Smells like trouble. Imperials only smile when they're up to something. Or when they're nervous. You came promptly. Thank the stars. The less time you spend mixing with the locals, the better. I trust my aide was quite explicit in informing you of the need for discretion here. I'm aware of your concerns, Ambassador. You haven't heard half of my concerns, Bounty Hunter, but this business with you is at the top of the list. That said, I look forward to being rid of General Redrish. That woman will be the death of me, if you aren't. I was told I'd be dealing with a Kuwati noble. 
not a Republic general. They are one and the same. General Thelonia Redbridge is a well-respected member of Kuwati aristocracy, a philanthropist, and a revolutionary. The Empire has lost a number of newly conquered worlds due to her interference, and we may well lose this one unless she's removed. Unfortunately, we're going to have to take the roundabout course, push her into the open. Any persons or interests she'd have a personal stake in protecting? Imperial intelligence suspects that she's behind the guerrilla attacks on our forces here, but we can't prove it. I believe your best course of action would be to root out General Redrich's officers in the field and gather evidence of her involvement. You're telling me I can't touch her, but I can shoot up her officers? You can't touch her here. Out in the wilderness, away from prying eyes, anything could happen. I'm afraid casualty reports are all we have to go on. You'll have to search around the ambush points for signs of the enemy. Take this holo recorder. If you make any discoveries, transmit the evidence to my frequency. If you insist, but I'll want copies for my scrapbook. Oh, for my own sanity, I'm going to pretend you're taking this seriously.